Hi, Jonathan Pickup from ArcOnCAD.com. I just saw somebody on the tech board having trouble with 3D snapping in Vectorworks 2009. So let me just show you a couple of tricks that I've learned. This is your snap to object constraint. If I double click on it, it brings up this dialog box for all your smart cursor settings for objects. I always turn this one here on as well, nearest point on edge. The other one is under Smart Point. I've got these set to Acquire Smart Edge and Set Datum. Now it's just going to be easier if I turn off the datum. So let's just look at that. Now when I move near a corner of an object, Vectorworks snaps and then I get a little, a little red square left behind. When I acquire the Smart Point on this corner, there's a tiny grey spot left behind on the screen, which is midway between the two points. That's my midpoint. Now you notice I've gone to my midpoint, I now have two more little grey spots, and I can snap to those as well. So 3D snapping in Vectorworks has improved a lot. I could go to that point. Let's go there. There. That's my midpoint midpoint again, so that's one quarter of the way up. I thought that was quite a neat trick. And 3D snaps also work with other things like the a long part, a long object. So there's a lot of snapping you could do. Thanks for watching. If you need more help, support online, or online courses, visit arconcad.com or arconcad.co.nz. Thanks for watching.